Hello, Christina Acosta here. I want to talk to you today about congruent aging and how this basically gray hair. And I grew my hair out, it was dyed um, dark brown. Actually, it's, it was originally mostly black, but with a little bit of brown highlights in it. And um, I dyed it most of my life until about eight years ago. When I was 53 years old, I stopped dyeing it. I'm 60 now. Well, that's seven years ago. Math isn't my thing. But anyway, um, I'm going to talk to you about what it did for me to age, to be um, congru biologically congruent with my look and my age. And because I'm 60 and I've taken good care of myself my whole life, I exercise and I eat right and, you know, all that stuff. Um, but, you know, I'm still older. So when, before I had my hair, um, you know, my hair was dyed brown, um, you know, from behind, especially when I was working out a lot and, uh, I looked pretty darn good from behind and younger guys would come up to me and, you know, maybe a concert or something and get my attention and I would turn around and they would be like, <gasps> and when that happened, I, it happened so often I named it, it's the insuck and the insuck became a a huge thing for me because the older I got as I went into my 40s and 50s and um, the insect became a more a much more of an often thing um, I haven't done anything else to myself so the insect um, you know is gonna be a little stronger uh, but anyway so I decided to to do this and I'm really happy with the results I didn't cut my hair I let it slowly grow out you know all the way down and tied it back really tightly so that when it first um, you know, when it was first growing gray, I had like, you know, kind of the snowball effect. Um, I was much more white than I expected to be. I wasn't aware. I thought I would be mostly like this. I was really surprised to have so much white on top. Anyway, I just want to, um, I think it's important uh, as maybe part of the concept of embracing our mortality. And God knows, you know, that's not easy for any of us. And, um, but it, it is a part of aging and, um, I think it's one of the um, concepts behind growing one's hair gray. And it's uh, a concept I am slowly embracing. I don't always love aging all the time, but uh, it's way better to be here than and grow old than not. So um, wishing you love and peace and uh, wherever you, whatever you choose to do with your hair, you have my blessings and um, peace.